at last, my precious boots. For I am, for I will soon change my name to the Green Bootman. Yes. But to become the Bootman, we must defeat Spider Guy. I know, my master. But don't worry, he'll be taken care of very well. I know he's very dirty minded, I can tell that. <laughs> huh? What? Oh, hey guys. Today I'm gonna beat the green. What was his name again? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> the green globin. Yeah. There he is, what the green globin. Wait, just... Wait, what's he doing? Uh, I was talking to my. Uh, I was talking to my boots. Thanks, I'm so jumping. When I will defeat uh, you, Spider Guy. What are you doing? Uh. Hey, come back. Right. <laughs> uh, let me know you need to fight me again. There. Hey, dude. Do you uh, mind if I join your review again? Well, this review, I mean. <laughs> I just kind of don't feel like there's any business in my world right now. Well, whatever is my universe, what do you uh, call it? Yeah. Sure. Okay, great. You like the Raimi films? Ooh, I love the Raimi ones. Yeah. Uh, a new oh, sorry. Alright, let's start the review. Ah yes, the good old Raimi films. I remember the times when they were always making a bunch of goofy stuff about it, but how's just the fun about it, really? I mean, it was like supposed to be like that anyways. And it's just like why most people really love it so much. I mean, I know it's meant to be a little... I mean, I know it's supposed to be a bit serious how Spider-Man is, but... Well, that's just how we all remember Raimi, really. <laughs> and we all mostly just still call him the goat, really. <laughs> so yeah, let's just get it started. Starting off the main character, Tom McGuire. Well, like I said, like I said before, just, yeah, 10 out of 10. <laughs> and main cast, well, yeah, I know Mary Jane, so, well, you know, uh, she makes the fit, she makes the stories just go really awkward, which is, well, but you have to not like it that much. So yeah, 7 out of 10, which is her specifically. Now, side characters, I don't really quite remember that much many side characters, besides, I guess, well, Uncle Ben and, well, the referee. <laughs> so, oh yeah, and those girls. I guess I will probably say, like, um, nine. I mean, they weren't bad. I mean, Uncle Ben, ten out of ten, obviously, but, like, the rest, mm, yeah, so. <laughs> Anyways. Now on to the side villains, which was, I think, well, the wrestling guy, which was pretty funny. And, well, the burglar, which, well, don't forget he was shown, like, a few times before the big review. <laughs> yeah. So I'd say, like, about 9 out of 10. And main villain... Oh, wait. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Well, that's about the main villain, as we know, Green Goblin. So, got drippy. Yeah. <laughs> well, anyways, about him. How do I put this? Yeah. Well, yeah, he's a bit cuckoo with the... <laughs> but, yeah, pretty much everything else. He pretty much represents a really good Green Goblin. Just the one problem, though. Well, as you know, the suit. I mean, I gotta admit, I like the suit. It's just, well... It's not really what we could have got, because, you know, it's pretty simple. You could just have to make it on and literally just get this. But, well, they got this before that, so... And I know the Statue Critic kind of, like, really hates the suit. But I'm not going to say it's, like, a really low score. I'm honestly... Because his performance is pretty good. So I'm just going to say 9 out of 10. Sorry. Well, it has its moments. And it's pretty much enjoyable to watch, honestly, but... Yeah, I gotta admit, it's a pretty... It's kind of, like, a bit goofy, but honestly... Well... Maybe there are, like, about a few miss errors, like the time when this Tom McGuire just got mad at his uncle. Just... Eh. 
But besides that, I just say everything else is really a bit fine, really. So, yeah. Maybe like about a... And then again, we can't forget about the awkward scenes. So maybe like about an 8 out of 10 for the action. Well, it's still pretty surprising that they actually had PG-13 at first and then slowly turn it into MA. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, uh... Besides that... <sighs> yeah, pretty much 10 out of 10 for the action scenes. Well, Donkey Kong, okay? Mans. Okay, well, we already know what this is going to be about, isn't it? <laughs> yes, the stupid awkward scenes of Mary Jane and Peter. Well, Maguire. <laughs> Just... <sighs> what do we say? Two out of ten! And the CGI, some people said it kind of, like, sucks, but... I mean, honestly, I don't know. I, was, I didn't really know what... I guess there was a few up up in the waywebs, so... Eh, seven. I mean, honestly, I guess it. I mean, then again, don't forget that was in the same year Lord of the Rings came out, so. But hey, it was practically still good. Gotta admit that. And finally, my. Well, favorite character, Tobey Maguire, which, yeah, pretty much, um, you know, 10 out of 10. And my least favorite character, Mary Jane. Okay, since Peter's not involved, let's just give her a quick 1 out of 10. Come on. Yeah, Mary Jane! <laughs> Honestly, I didn't totally think for me to get, like... Honestly, I'd say, like, 7.5. 7. Pretty much. Anyways, uh, good night. <laughs>